Hey guys, it's Bruchette with Sandia Seed Company, and today I want to talk about one of my favorite root crops, daikon radishes. One of the reasons why I love it, partly because I love making kimchi, but also because it's a triple threat in the garden. So you can grow it to consume, to use them in many recipes in the kitchen. And also it's a really good plant for developing good soil. So we can see this guy here and look how big he is, okay? And that's uh, not even as big as they will get. They can get huge. So they actually act like little soil drills and it, they will grow in relatively poor soil. And so if you have a part of the garden that seems really compact and the soil's not doing great, you can grow daikon radishes and they basically break up the soil, which means they're gonna allow water to get in and nutrients and air. And you're going to end up having much happier garden soil just after one season of growing these. The other reason why we love to grow these is like our video on favas, they produce a lot of biomass. So in a very small area, we can grow daikons and I will use this root in recipes, in my kimchi, um, for anything that I can. And then all of this mat, this green matter up top will go to the chickens. Whatever's left over from that will go into the compost. So I can use this plant in so many different ways on our small farm and it, it, it makes it much more valuable for us because we can get so much out of a very small space. Now, something to remember is that daikon radishes take a lot longer than normal, than normal radishes. I mean, look how big that guy is. It's a big one. It's not going to be 30 days um, like a normal radish, especially if you're growing it for the purpose of helping your soil structure. You want to let this get as big as you can so that it breaks up the soil. Um, they don't take up a lot of space otherwise. Let's see, I don't think this one's very big. but. Radishes will grow really deep and you want to let their taproot get as deep as possible so that when, when you pull them out, you've got a nice deep hole which air and moisture can get into, which is really the cornerstone of a soil that is teeming with life. So give them a try. Some people don't know uh, how amazing they are and I'm here to tell you there's so many benefits and they're delicious.